So in this tutorial, I'm going to look at how we can resolve these uh, famous three errors that usually pop up here in the uh, Facebook SDK. So first of all, one of them being the your Android default, I'm sorry, your Android debug key store file is missing. The other one also talking about the open SSL is not found. And then the final one being the Java home environment reference a directory and something something about it does not contain the jar which is required to process android libraries all right so stay tuned we're gonna look at that right now all right so the first one we're going to tackle here is the missing key store file so i'm going to go ahead and click the android the facebook um, um, plug in here and just it edit edit settings and right away we'll see that it says your Android debug key store file is missing so what that simply means guys is that there's a location right here in your local drive in your user um, computer name and then your dot Android folder there should be a key store file here a debug dot key store that's the default spot where it looks for it if it's not there then it's correct it is definitely missing so an easy way to fix this you won't need command prompt or anything like that we just use unity actually to fix this just switch over to um your player settings and in here you can go on down to player and then in the publish publishing settings just go ahead and click manage key store click the drop down create new and just say in dedicated location um, you know put, put it wherever you want to put it I'll just put this one on the desktop why not and um, you give it a name but what you could do is actually just put it straight into the path where it needs to go leads in and then dot Android right here in this folder and then just name it debug right then hit save once you've done that, you see the path right here. It's going exactly where it needs to go. Of course, keep in mind, mine says Leto. Yours will be your computer name. And then just proceed with filling out the information. I'm going to fill out some demo information right now. And then whatever you want to call it over here. Um, All right, and just proceed to fill out the remaining of your information. I believe um, after this password here, I should be good enough to create the key. But um, I suggest just fill out the re remaining that you need. I hit create and accept. So now, in here is the key store generated, and right away you might see it right away, like I did right now. That error has been fixed. So if it still says you have the key store, um, the key store not found, file not found issue, I suggest just close Unity. Definitely kill the process completely and then reopen it. Now, if you're experiencing the open SSL not found, then this is how we're gonna fix that. For this one, I'm gonna drop a link in the description, and you're gonna head over to this site right here. And you're gonna scroll down and just go ahead and download the executable or the I the MSI and install this now I've already installed it and where it goes is right here in the um, program files and right here open SSL dash win 64 and so what you want to do is go to the bin folder see this bin folder right here and then just copy your path have that copied and this is what we're going to do next i am done with the site so i'll close the site but this is what we're going to do next we're going to head over to the control panel once you're at your control panel um your icons might look like this categorized but you could just filter it down to small or even uh, large and what you want to go is to your system or your system right here 
and from system you can go to your advanced system settings and from here you want to go to your uh, environmental variables there's an easier way to get to this I'll show you if you have Windows 10 you could indeed just search it you could say um, variables or variables can't spell today variables just like that see and then it's the first thing that usually pop up if you type variables first thing that pops up at the search click that and then you're right here anyways anyways you can enter the environmental variables right here and what you want to search for is down in here you want to find path so remember the error it says make sure that the open SSL is installed and that it is in your path so now we're saying path this is actually what it's referring to so down in the system variables go to path hit edit and you want the link to it to be here not open SSH that's something else so just hit new and paste that path that we had copied earlier see Windows uh, program files open SSL dash win 64 then slash bin once that's done I'll go ahead and hit OK okay and now I'll close out of the environment of variables notice that you don't see anything here happened what you need to do is to kill Windows um, kill the unity then head back over here and also kill the process from the taskbar here then I'll load right back into my something clever project and just give it a second here while it loads and now that it's loaded head back up to the Facebook edit settings and voila so now this is done it's in it's good so here is a secondary um, a third error that you might see pop up and um, this is the one about the key tool not found make sure that Java is installed and that Java tool is in your path this one requires us to go back to the um, the variables environmental variables path and add in another um, element so notice I'm doing we're doing all of this just to be able to see the debug uh, Android key hash so that you can connect your game with uh, Facebook all right so what we're going to need to do now is actually head into the edit and then scroll down to preferences and we'll see all of these right here this is the tool Android SDK tool install so this is where it's installed. Um, this is what, oh, I'm sorry. The open JDK. That's the one we are actually looking for. So what you want to do is copy the path. And we're going to go into folder here. And just paste. And we go to bin. Then you see that inside here, there is indeed a key tool. Um, inside the bin. So you'd copy this path all the way up to the bin, just like we did the other time. And we're gonna go to the environmental variables again. And back into the same one called path. In path, you're going to edit and add new and add this one leading all the way up to the bin. All the way in there, okay? All the way up to bin, just like that. Once that is in, you should be all set for um, for now. But that would take care of this issue. But here's the thing: the other error that would pop up. Why not fix it while we're here? So head back into the environmental bin, and what you want to do is for that Java home issue that we're having right in here. Do not click in the path. Instead, just click new. And you're going to create one call Java underscore home, all capitalized. 
and you're gonna paste that same URL except except the bin. So take the bin off and then hit OK, save, close. And then same thing now is we need to reload Unity one more time. So close Unity, close the task, complete. Once the project opens back up, I'll go back up to the uh, Facebook tab and edit settings and ta-da! You have done it. You have finally defeated the many errors of the Facebook SDK. So there we are. Now you should be all set. Hey guys, thanks for checking this one out and I'll catch you in the next one.